special education teachers have requested a way to have questions and options read to their students in the electronic quizzes they take in Moodle. And there is a way to do that. You're looking at an example right now. The question, how many days are in a week, have four options for the student to select. For special needs students that need to have this read to it, there is a player bar where the students can hit the play button and hear the question and the options. Additionally, they can play that back as many times as they need. So how do you create this? Once your quiz is created in Moodle, you then need to create a little sound file for each question that needs audio. And here is how you can do that. I will recommend using a program like Audacity that is a free sound recording program. Open Audacity by double clicking it and selecting open. When the screen appears, all you have to do is have a microphone attached to your computer and then click the record button, the little red one in the middle. As you speak, you should notice the waves move up and down on the screen. When you're done with the question and the options, just hit the stop button and then save it by going to the file menu and instead of actually saving it you want to export it and I would recommend exporting it as an mp3 file. Select where you want to save it and give it a file name. At the next screen you can either fill in the information or you can cancel past that. And then I'm going to close out of Audacity and go back into Moodle. Now I'm going to go back to my quiz bank and at my quiz bank I see all of the questions and I'll just pick this first one and I will select the little edit option which is the hand with the pencil and when the quiz appears I would normally put my cursor at the end of the sentence and hit enter because this is where I want my little player bar to appear with my cursor where I want the player to appear, I will go up to the options and select Moodle Media. I will then click find or upload a file. Having upload a file selected, I will then choose browse and I will find where I put my file and upload it. And finally, I just have to select the insert button. And what I see in the editing view of Moodle is just the name of the file. I'm going to scroll to the bottom and save this. And then back at the question bank, I can preview the question. And now I actually see the player bar listed in the question. And that is how you can add audio to your Moodle quizzes.